Today we are exploring the tide pools at Salt Point State Park in Sonoma County. We see the harbor seals relaxing on the rocks, and further out we see the last of the gray whale migration heading north. Here on the shore, among the rocks, there are some early spring blooms. Here is Toxicoscordion fremontii and Primula hendersonii. One species we are lucky to find today is a diminutive geophyte. The bulb grows in open grasslands and woodlands throughout much of Northern California. It is Calicordus tolmii. Species of Calicordus generally bloom in spring or early summer, and here we find Calicordus tolmii blooming on the earlier side, in foggy mid-April. The name Calicordus means beautiful grass due to the linear to lanceolate leaves. Species in the genus Calicordus are distinguished from other members of the lily family, the Liliaceae, by their short style, septicidal capsule, and differentiation of perianth segments into distinctive petals and sepals, rather than having all perianth parts similar in appearance, as in most lilies. There are six stamens and a nectary gland at the base of each petal. There are four general floral forms found in the genus Calicordus. There are fairy lanterns or globe lilies, which have nodding flowers as seen here in Calicordus albus. The second floral form are generally called cat's ears, and they have petals that are dense with inner hairs. Calicordus tolmii is commonly known as pussy ears for the same reason. The inner surface of the petals resembles the hairy interior of a cat's ear. The third form, the mariposa lilies, have bowl-shaped flowers, as in Calicordus argillosus. And finally, the star tulips have narrower sepals, and they usually have glabrous petals, as in Calicordus umbilatus. There are approximately 67 species of Calicordus that are distributed throughout North and Central America, with the center of diversity being California. 45 species of Calicordus occur in California, half of which are rare or threatened. Many species have very limited geographic distributions and are adapted to local conditions. Some are known to be restricted to serpentine soils and have adapted to survive with higher and potentially toxic concentrations of trace minerals, like Calicordus abispoensis. Calicordus tolmii is common, occurring from the Willamette Valley in Oregon to south of San Francisco. Calicordus tolmii has erect flowers which become nodding in fruit. The petals may be white, pink, or purple, and are less than 28 millimeters long. They are conspicuously hairy on the inner surface, like other cat's ears. The petals are obovate to wedge-shaped and have ciliate margins, except at the top. This plant is small and easily overlooked when growing in tall grasses, but if you find it, you'll never forget it. Thanks for watching and learning about the genus Calicordus.